Hi my little buddies, I am back hopefully to impress you. I actually just did a review video so if you see me wearing the same thing that is why. But I wanted to do this haul for you. This is a Dollar Tree haul, also a Target haul. So I wanted to do this little haul for you guys. Well, it's a lot of stuff. But <laughs> um, I want to do this haul for you guys and hopefully you guys enjoy. So stay tuned if you want to see what I got. Okay, so I'm going to start off by my Target haul first and just get it over with before I jump into the Dollar Tree. So at Target, they had some little clearance bags. And these just remind me of the little Michael Kors bags, um, pouches that they had. But these were on clearance for $2.38, a regular $7.99. And they're just these little things you can hook on your keychain or your purse. And you could put change in here or whatever you want. It has a little button that just closes. You want to be careful with change because it's just a button. But they are so adorable. It even has like a little pouch on the side. They're so cute. So I got the gold one and I got the rose gold one. Um, as I said, they were $2.38 a piece. And then I also found this cute one, which was this little dangly um, tassel. And it just has, it's like a leather feel. Um, and then it has this little moon thing here and... You know, just a cute little tassel for my purse. And then I thought this one was really cute. This is a little gold one, but it has like the um, metal tassels. thought that would be cute. So I got that. Oh, wait. This one was on clearance for $2.38 also. And then this one was $1.78. And that's it for the tassels. And then also at the Target in the dollar, um, I guess they call it bullseye spot. Or I don't know what it's called. Um, I got this cute little, I guess it's a jewelry, um, jewelry holder where it holds necklaces and all that. I paid $3 for this. I just thought this was really cute as decor because as I said, I'm going to be changing my room out. Hopefully I have it painted and done all out um, by the spring, summer, something like that. Um, and I want to do it in like black and gold and stuff like that. So um, I got this little accent piece to put in there. And then I was hesitant. I paid $12 for this. I wasn't going to get it. I believe this is a mailer holder, I think it's called. Um, letter letter sorter but I'm gonna use this for some of my favorite makeup palettes to put onto my vanity because it was gold and I just love the sturdiness of it so I'm gonna put some of my favorite makeup palettes that I want to be like hands close by <laughs> so I paid like 12 bucks for that but it's okay and then I also um, I paid a dollar for these I think these are these cute little erasers um, uh, you are so cute and they are popsicle erasers and they look like this thought they were adorable and then I paid three dollars for these little cupcake stands or you can use either big cupcakes or little cupcakes or a cake but I thought these were really cute to use as a candle um, pedestal so I got these for my room also I got two of those and I'll probably bejewel it or whatever. So I just got two. They had them in red and I think pink or something. But I didn't bother. I wanted white because I'm, I'm trying to get out of that pink kit, guys. It's my favorite color and it's so hard. But I got to get out of it because I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to do something a little different. And then I found these, um, thank God, uh, I mean, thank good thoughts, little booklet thing here. It's like, um, I paid $3 for it. And it has like this envelope pocket here, some paper here, and it is like one of them boards. What do they call them again? Paper clips. So I thought this was really cute. So I went ahead and grabbed that for $3. And then, oh yeah, and then you guys know about that Kroger's I was telling you about, the Marketplace one where they have um, clothes and houseware and all that stuff well I found these cute little pillows I went ahead and got them because they're white and gold and I just love them they just say love and they were $14 a piece $14.99 and I think they're on sale so I got them for $9.99 a piece and it just says love and it has the gold trim I thought these were really clean and sleek and these will be nice in my room um, when I get it together so I'm just going to keep them in the bag so they don't get dirty until then Okay, and I think we're going to jump into the Dollar Tree now. So, <clears throat> at the Dollar Tree, I found these perfect size um, Duncan Hines Key Lime Pies. 
And we actually purchased some from Kroger's not long ago um, for Valentine's Day. And I got the heart ones and they were, it was strawberry with lemon glaze and red velvet. But I see they had the key lime ones at the Dollar Tree. Also found these pastry crisps, which I found before. Um, this time I found another flavor. Also, I found the strawberry, which was a new flavor because last time they only had blueberry. So it was good to find strawberry. And then I got some of these Glade bags. The Glade is bringing out the um, 10 bag ones um, and they're the bigger ones. I love these ones better than the hefty ones because they have like a flat seal. So it seals very easily instead of... Um, the rounder seals, if that makes sense, I don't even really know how to explain it to you. But it has like this flat seal um, on it and it's airtight. You get 10 in there. I've been buying those lately. Got some gum. I was looking for that. <laughs> Matter of fact, I was looking for it so much I thought I lost it so I bought another pack. <laughs> another box of the Glade. I've been buying them and the smaller ones. I also picked up this by iHome. Um, this is the Ultra Clear for Samsung Galaxy 5. I don't even know why I got this because I'm about to get a new phone soon. Um, but I need to put something on there because I've been really, really dangerous with my phones lately. I don't know why. If any of you guys have a Galaxy S5 and need some phone cases, I have a ton of them. So please just let me know. Um, yeah, so I got that. And then I also got this Deception book um, by Naomi Chase. And... I wanted to give this a read. It looked like it was pretty interesting. I'm into stuff like that. And then I got some more of these little ID card things. Um, they're keychain badge holders, but I use them for my ID. I take these off and I put my, my identification in here and then I put it in my wallet. And I swear, anytime I go somewhere where they want need to see my ID for anything, they'd be like, oh my God, where did you get that? Every single time, like that is so cute. Because my ID just sits in there nicely. But I don't know. <laughs> so I got the it. I also finally found these little things that people were buying. These are the Reese Lava Cake Makers in less than five minutes. So I figured I'd get one and maybe the kids want to have some. They also had the Hershey one, but I didn't get it. Um, guys, I was so excited. I finally found these containers. The only thing, I was a little disappointed because the lids don't really snap on there. So it is kind of dangerous. So when you go to pull it out, you want to be careful. But I bought three of them. I bought two for myself and one for my daughter's college dorm. So they're just egg keepers. Um, a long time ago, I was going to buy one from a few different stores, which were so much more sturdier than these. I didn't, but I was so glad to find these. So yeah here's the other one and I also found this cute little book I had to get it I figured I'd throw it because I want to do a giveaway I want to do a daughter mother giveaway or if it does, if it's mother niece or niece whatever but I want to do like a mother daughter giveaway and I've been like stocking some stuff um, for that so I found this cute little book and it is Disney Frozen um, Anna's book of secrets keep your dreams and secrets safe and I just thought this was so cute it got this little um glittery wraparound thing and it's just so adorable I had to get it and it just has like of course um pages like this in here and you can write your own stuff in here um friends low down um you write your own information follow your heart um, if your friend said my dream was silly, then I would give it up, true or false. Stuff like that, like the kids get to write their own stuff in here. So I just thought that was so adorable. I don't even remember what Dollar Tree I got that from. <laughs> I also bought a water that I forgot about. <laughs> and I found a couple pairs of nails that I have not had before. And they're just, the, and I was hesitant on these because <clears throat> they weren't like a woo factor, but I was like, they're different. Um, so I got these marble looking ones and these two colors. I picked up some Color Mate contact, contacts, Color Mate eyelashes, which I thought were really, really cute because they're so full. And I've tried them before and I really like them. And then I got some of these boot laces. Um, you get two in there. <clears throat> and... I bought these because my husband has work boots that have these rope type laces so he can change them out 
And then I got myself some of these shoelaces. They say glow in the dark. I didn't want no glow in the dark, but they didn't have no other white ones that just weren't glow in the dark. So, <laughs> but I got them for my shoes. I had to change my shoelaces out. And then I got this LA Color Eyeliner Pencil. I wanted to give this a try. Um, it's just a black liner and another color mate. And I found some more cereal. This is the Nature Valley Raisin Oat Clusters. Um, my husband and them, they like this kind of cereal. I'm not into all them oats and all that, except for oatmeal, but not like clustered and nuts and all that in my cereal. I found these makeup bags everybody was finding. Um, I didn't really like the other ones. I like this one because it was more girly, but the other ones just didn't make sense to me. Um, so it just, this one says like more of like cosmetic stuff. So this one was powder, lipstick, brushes, eyeshadow, eyeliners, mascara, open at your own risk, very black, waterproof. Yes, um, like just stuff like that. It just had more meaningful stuff to me, so... Then I also got this, um, um, what are they called? Uh, Monsters High book. And it's funny because my do my oldest daughter, she's so silly. She's like, oh my God, you got a Monsters High book? I love Monsters High. I want that. So I'm like, okay, if you want it. But I actually got it for my niece, but um, she probably ain't going to take it anyway. And then I got these nails. I got two packs of these. I believe just two. Dollar Tree has some cute little ones. I have some on now that I bought a while ago. They're cute just to slap on, you know? I got another one of them um, ID holders that seems to have something on it. And this is what it looks like. It's the pink one. I grabbed two of the Pampa mushrooms. I swear by these. Love them. Clean them and put them in my food all the time. I also grabbed some of this Pure Silk Sensitive Skin Therapy Moisturizing Soothing Bacterials with uh, Botanicals um, with Aloe Rust Proof Can. It is just shaving cream. Why did I have to read all that? And then I also grabbed another one of the hand soap. This is the Yellow Raspberry and Black Sugar and it smelled really good so I went ahead and grabbed it. It smells good. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of... Um, grapefruit a little bit. It's very citrusy. And then I grabbed another loofah. Another pack of nails. So I guess I did get more of that kind. And then I found some of these cute little headbands. So I grabbed them. You guys know I love my headbands. So I got that one. I got the red one. And I got the gray one. And I also grabbed some of these uh, microfiber class, the cloths. These are the bonus ones. Um, you get four instead of three. I like to use those to remove makeup. And I got these nails also, which I thought were really cute and fun with the paisley. And I found these lemon pound cake um, candles. I don't know how they smell. I've seen a lot of people, you guys know they make actual cakes and donuts and stuff. I've seen some people hauling them. I didn't really hear any reviews about them, but I'm definitely going to give this one a try. And if you guys want to know, just let me know down below and I'll tell you how it smells. So I grabbed a couple of those. And then I found these nails, which I thought were so pretty. Look at those. That would be really pretty in the spring. So I grabbed those. What do they say? Dream on. Yeah, they just say dream on. <laughs> so cute. I guess I really did like those nails at the time, eh? Some more paisley. Some more of those ones. I found this ribbon, and it's, like, really cool. So I'm going to use that on a DIY. I got some more secret deodorant. I don't know why I even bought this. It is a bandage. Um, I think because it was pink, and I was like, wow, let me just buy it just in case I ever need it. I hope I don't, but it can happen, so I'd rather rock out with pink. <laughs> If it did. <laughs> okay. I also found these nails, which I thought these ones were really cool. Uh-oh. And I got some stampy things. Well, first I bought some safety pins because I need some. I ran out. And I found these little stamp plates. And then what you do is you put these little stamps on them and you could use them. 
So I got this set, which says, wishing you a happy birthday, wish big, um, and celebrate today, and stuff like that. So just birthday stuff. Then I got the one that says, hello, and it's just got these flowers. I got this one that says, remember, and it has a, so I figured this would be really cool for my planner. And then I also got some stamp ink. Not so sure how that's going to work out because a lot of times I've bought stamp ink from the Dollar Tree and it dried out. <laughs> also found some more of these containers. So I bought one of these for a DIY project. Um, and I can't remember what I was going to do with it before. I mean, what I was going to... Um, DIY, how I was going to DIY it. When I bought it, I knew. So it'll come back to me. <laughs> okay. Also, I grabbed some of these broccoli and cheddar um, um, sidekick type things. Rice sides. These have a lot in them. So, I got two of those. Another one of them containers. I really must have knew I was going to be doing something. Maybe I bought it for cotton balls and all that. And then I got some of this super classic yellow uh, mustard. It's 100% natural. So, yeah, and it's gluten-free. So I got that. And then I got some of this shoe polish. I was hesitant because, listen, I don't know if you guys can hear that. It kind of sounds really watery. So I'm not how, I don't know how it's going to work. <laughs> And then I got these LA Color Brow Stencils. I don't even know why the hell I got these because I don't never draw on my eyebrows. Ever, ever, ever have I drew on my eyebrows. So I don't even know why I got them. I really just don't. I just don't. I think I just sometimes waste money. I did that time, I know that. Then I found the red velvet one. So I got three of the strawberry, three of the blueberry, three of the red velvet. But early on I had got some, some of the blueberry ones so I have plenty of them. Um, my family loves them. I'm not, I, I don't I don't mind them because they just remind me of pop tarts, but they're not like my favorite thing. Um, some more of the rope boot things for the hubby's boot. Um, another key lime. I bought some of this Alfredo sauce. I'm not sure how good this is. Um, I'm gonna try it. If I like it, I'll use it. But if I don't, I'm throwing it out because I'm gonna make some chicken Alfredo. Or shrimp, uh, sh uh, shrimp, shrimp, <laughs> Alfredo. So you gotta have good Alfredo sauce. Otherwise, it's just pointless, right? I think that's it. That's everything in my haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, stay tuned for my next videos upcoming. Um, and until then, you know what to do. I'll let you, girl. Love you guys. Bye.